Hello everyone, we're here on Ensk in the M103. We're sitting at the top of the list, so we should be able to have a good time here. Uh, so today, I've got a couple things that I wanted to mention to you. And the first of those things is a new series coming to my channel. Probably tomorrow will be the first episode. The day after this clip goes up, after this video itself goes up. And that'll be Bioshock Infinite. Yes, that's right. I've been playing, thinking about playing that game for a while. I've always kind of been humming and hawing about it since time it came out which was I think March of, of this year spring this year I think and I finally decided you know what I'm gonna get it and I got it I've been playing it for the last couple weeks and I have been really enjoying it I actually recorded the whole series I wasn't sure if I was gonna post it on YouTube or not looks like I'm going to uh, it's been just so much fun it turned into one of those games that was like, hmm, I don't know if I should get it, to possibly my most, my favorite game ever. And it's been great, so I really suggest you guys check that out. If you've been wanting to get it yourself, or been thinking about getting it yourself, then please do before you watch my series. I don't want to ruin it for you. Uh, but as a heads up for that series, the first episode, it's mostly just building the storyline. There's no real action in there at all. Uh, it is... A, a good storyline. It's a really good storyline. Uh, the second episode, about halfway through, the action actually starts to happen, and then near the end for the last episode, which I think there's going to be 18 total episodes for the series. Um, it it's crazy. It gets you thinking so much at the end, and every time that game started to get a little bit dull feeling, everything just turned around and suddenly they threw a new twist at you, and it's it was just amazing. But anyway, that's coming out tomorrow. Feel free to check that out. Please do. I'm sure you'll all enjoy it. Uh, in the meantime, we've got a battle here with the M103. And we're in a platoon, if you, as you may have noticed. Another M103. And we are going to kick some butt. Now, unfortunately, at the end of this video, you'll notice that I didn't add a screenshot. Or multiple screenshots like I normally do for the after battle report. Uh, I'm kind of kicking myself for that, but... That's something I can't fix now. I still have the replay saved on my hard drive for this this battle. However, this battle was recorded in World of Tanks 8.7, and now we're in version 8.8. .8. So I, I tried. It wouldn't let me open that file now. it's Sometimes when there's a new update, you can still open older replays. Other times you can't. I guess it depends exactly what they do. But that's a bit of a shame. But oh well, you guys still get to see the battle. And isn't that all that really matters? <laughs> So here's that, we're taking care of this T29, team effort, group effort, two tier 9s versus one tier 7, that seems fair, right? Oh, and then here comes a tier 9 to help him out, oh, it's, now his gun hurts, you need to aim low, that's where his weak spot is on that bottom plate. Now I'm thinking, why am I backing up, I should really be going and rushing beside him, but it's a little late for that, now we're tracked, we're going to need to shoot him, maybe we can shoot him inside, that's a pretty high angle we shot him at, but it was still enough to penetrate. Our platoon buddy is gone. We need to stay beside him. If he can get his gun around, then we're toast. Teammate helps us out. They're Ferdy, though. He's coming for us. Our ammo rack is hit, but we're going to use our repair kit on that in just a moment. I was going to go for the Ferdy, but then that T29 there peeked around. That is a T29, right? Maybe that's a T34. I can't read the names anymore. I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, but now we're going to go finish off this Ferdy because... The other tank there is finished off. He's going to try shooting at us. This silly guy. He just bounces off our turret. You don't shoot down 103's turret if you want to hurt it. And that ram was almost a really bad idea. It did more damage to us than it did to him. And if we would have rammed each other much harder, then I'd be dead right now. Because see how little health we have? And I make some kind of stupid decisions with this little amount of health we have left. And you'll see that in just a moment. Uh, because we need, I was thinking about backtracking here. I was going to go back to base because I didn't want our base to get captured after all that. Because we did so good in town. I was quite happy with that. I still have no kills, but that's fine. It's the damage that gets you the real credits and the real experience. The kills is just kind of for bragging rights. Uh, if you get a kill by doing the last 100 damage to someone or just plain damage them for more than 100 damage, I'll take the, just the, the plain damage. <laughs> So we're going to go finish this, this guy off, hopefully. Hopefully he won't finish us off, because we have so little health. We can go haul down, though. Chances are he'll just bounce off our turret. Luckily, he did. Hopefully he doesn't shoot us through the window here. I don't know what his reload time is like. But somehow we got through his turret. His turret's usually pretty bouncy. Let's try this again. We once again put ourselves in line of fire. Took a hit. And 
and that was that. But hope you guys enjoyed. Hopefully you'll be around tomorrow to watch the Bioshock Infinite series come out. I think you guys really enjoy that. See you next time. Bye-bye.